So 2020 has been cruel. It's been brutal, especially for the um, certain communities. And you know what? I want to give you 10 positive affirmations for our black students because they need it. They need to know that they're just as important as everybody else. for your students. How do you use them? Um, well, you can make posters, have them make posters, that would be cool. Um, so they'll start internalizing the, their affirmations and then they would be able to um, put it up and they know that they've made it and they're gonna start making it a part of their regular routine because that's what an affirmation is, always doing it, right? It's like a mantra. Um, make post notes or post-it notes where they you can write it on there and like every morning kind of give them an affirmation on their desks so they feel good about themselves for the rest of the day especially if you teach elementary and younger where they don't move around as much they get to have that on their desk all day um, for the older grades it would be nice to go to your class because that's the class that makes me feel great about myself all right um a daily deck now, this is something that I'm probably gonna try when we get in the building, even though I'm not sure how we can touch things as the COVID is rampant in the country. But um, have like a stack of cards um, and have affirmations on them. So every day they come in, they either respond to one, or you know what, I need you to think about this affirmation today. That's you all day, all right? So, you know, have it in a card, we can have them play games with it, figure out different types of games, and I'll probably think of something later. Um, and create t-shirts and crafts. Have them make it a part of their, their system. Not just make a poster, but be a little bit more creative with their affirmation. Buy some white tees and have them um, design the shirt or have them just make it out of paper and design the shirt. Just have them do stuff that makes um, cementing the, the um, affirmation a part of their heart and their minds, okay? So we can get our kids to be stronger, emotionally stronger, um, socially stronger, academically, just stronger in general and great citizens.
Thanks for coming to class today. You and your kids go out there and be great.